Okay, this is part two. Hello, females, because I know there are several of you watching because y'all like to cheat and want just all the information and everything. We can't have none for ourselves. <laughs> I'm joking. I'm glad that you females are watching as well. But let's jump in the quotes for guys. Gentlemen, if you treat her like a queen before you show her you're a king, She'll treat you like a servant because that's what you'll be. Every man needs at least one place of complete vulnerability. That place where he doesn't have to prove that he is a man, but reassured that he is. The first part is gentlemen. So if you know that you are not a gentleman, Please turn off this video. I'm joking. I'm joking. You, please stay because you need to fix up. You need to tighten up. If you want a lady, then you need to be a gentleman. That's that's how it works. So ladies don't go after whatever you might be at this present moment in time. But we, 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 can, we can fix that. We can fix that. Don't worry about it. If you treat this female that you might be particularly interested in in such a way that she starts to believe that she is royalty, because you basically worship the ground that she walks on. If you do that, if you just put her on that pedestal and just worship her before you establish who you are to her, then she will establish within herself who you are to her. And since you already treat her as if she is above you, then she will treat you as if you are below her because technically that's where you'll be. That's what you'll be and you will be her servant. Literally, you will just weigh on her hand and foot and you will become her servant and just do whatever. I mean, arguably, you would kind of do that anyway because that's what gentlemen do. But if she doesn't know that you deserve to be pampered and respected and, and treated as if you are royalty as well, if you don't show her that before you get deep into calling her a queen and putting her up there, then she'll stay up there and leave you down where you are. She'll do that. And I'm not saying that it's a bad thing or women are, are so, so evil that they'll do that on purpose. I'm saying that if you give her the leeway, the, the opportunity to do that, she will take it subconsciously and not even realize that that's what she's doing. And the second part, I intentionally included that one because I know that some females will be watching this one as well and they need to know this information as well. But if you are a man, you call yourself man as we back home in the islands. If you need man, that's what we would say, if you need man, then you will know that you need to have a place of complete vulnerability and comfortability. Probably your own home where your wife, your queen, your, your lady is you need to have that place to know that you could just relax and just not try to seem all macho like you don't have feelings and and emotions and all of that all the time but still reassured by your queen by your lady your special lady friend that you are that king you are that man you're her man you know you need you need that place because if you don't have that place you will find yourself looking elsewhere for it. And if you have to look for it, then it doesn't exist. You have to create it. And when you create it, it has to remain that. In other words, if you have your house or your man cave or whatever, and you bring your lady into that place, and then she turns it into something other than what you are comfortable and vulnerable in, then you mess up. <laughs> you mess up because you didn't show that you were a king. You didn't show her that this is my castle and you will treat it as such. You don't have to be forceful, but you let her know that this is what it is. You exercise your own humility as well. And you tell her, this is what it is. This is what it has to be. This is what I need as a man. And this is what you need to give me as your man. If you are my queen, if you are my lady. And she will comply because you already established that within yourself to her that this is what you are. And then you show her that she's a queen and all of that, you know, all the gooey stuff. So then together, you guys, you know, you build your empire or you just rule in your little apartment or flat or house or mansion or 
whatever you want to call it, whatever it is, wherever, wherever it is, and you two rule together as king and queen in that space. And in that space, you know that you don't have to be how you are outside of that space where you go on your job to work or around other kings, around other queens. You need to let her know, however you choose, that this is the space where you need to feel comfortable and vulnerable and reassured that you still demand. You still, yeah, you know, because this is what you need. You don't want to be running around the world like a headless chicken and you still actually have a queen at home or a potential queen at home who is not doing her job. Now, I'm going to get back to the females at a later date, but for now, males, know yourself and make sure the female knows who yourself is. And females, just like I said in the last video, those of you who are still here, know yourself and make sure that he knows yourself as well. And that's all I have to say about that for right now.